Hi, today I want to share with you how I draw bubbles on a light background. You may have watched uh, many videos on YouTube uh, about uh, drawing uh, bubbles on a dark background, especially um, black background because it's easier. But uh, since I usually draw them um, with other things and I don't want to draw them on a, a black or dark background, so I have to explore how to draw them on a light background, but still uh, they make sense and look uh, realistic. I drew this in 2019. And then this one in 2020, uh, some of the colors have come off, uh, especially the pink colors. And since the beginning of this year, I started to draw different effects of uh, January, February, the name of the months, just for fun. And then in December, I decided to draw bubbles again. I also tried to draw bubbles on a black background. But uh, as I said just now, I think drawing on a, a light background is more versatile. So I tried uh, uh, to explore it. And for this one, I uh, painted uh, the background uh, green because usually you see bubbles uh, outdoor and uh, 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 in a park. So the background is usually green. Then I um, tried to draw on a white background. And then when designing December, I drew this, but then I found that uh, it's uh, against what I found out from the real photos. Although I'm quite happy with this drawing and these two bubbles. Then I drew this again, but I wasn't happy about it. And then I came up with this last night. So let me share with you my theory of drawing bubbles. First of all, usually you see bubbles outdoor, not indoor, right? Even if it's indoor, you seldom see them in a very dark place. So I think it's not realistic to um, draw bubbles on a black background. Secondly, and also because of the reason you usually see them outdoor, many people draw the highlights of the bubbles like this. They may not draw the cross here, but usually they actually draw a scrunched window. And as I said just now, uh, usually you see bubbles outdoor, right? When you play in the park. So it should not be very sharp. So in here, you see that I only draw the highlights like this. Also, when I studied the real photos, I found that no matter it's a dark or a light background, usually there is a belly band in the middle. I think it's because uh, light from all directions, but uh, in the middle, because uh, it's, uh, it's just like water, when you see through it, you don't see much of uh, reflections, right? You see through it. But even if it's a light background or even a white background, because uh, there are two layers, altogether two layers of the bubble surface, bubble surface so it is darker here. And also because of uh, uh, the reflection of uh, some images, 
and uh, it's also scrunched like the uh, the the reflection of the uh, window is like this and it is a mirror image like this that's why i draw some dark blurred images in here in the middle and it's also darker in the middle uh, 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 belly band here that's why i said uh, this drawing is not uh, very correct because uh, i um painted it white in the middle so this one is not very correct either because uh, the uh, the, the, the line here is too sharp. It should be a smooth transition from the outer uh, loop to the second loop. So I think this one is uh, more correct, but um, maybe later I'll find something wrong with this, then I'll improve my uh, technique, uh, improve my way of drawing bubbles. Then I will share with you again. So now let's uh, come to the uh, drawing part. And uh, I uh, made, because uh, it, it was too uh, very long, so um, I didn't uh, make the video, but I just uh, made the step photos.